the next study I'd like to talk about are lung symptoms that are common among users of e-cigarettes and related products. As you know, e-cigarette use has been at the forefront of the national media over the last few years. And the American Heart Association is playing a large role in uh, limiting its availability to children and young adults with, with its advocacy groups in Albany and in New York and other places. In, the, in this study, in a 2016 survey, one third of users of e-cigarettes or related products reported lung irritation or injury that affected their ability to, to breathe and uh, long-term excess capacity. The symptoms were much more common in those who use flavored vaping products, as well as those who were using devices that could be refilled with purchased or home-made liquids. 